Alright, welcome back to Cold Fear. Okay. Let's try this room for the third time. No funny stuff. Just straight on through, and I'm not going to use my shotgun to kill the thing. No. No shotgun. No shotgun. No shotgun. I'm going to use my AK. Okay. Yep, skip that. Charges. And wait for it to come closer. Oh my god, look at those barrels move. Come on, get up. Where'd you go? Where'd you go? How did you get all the way over there? Oh yes, perfect! Yes, 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 yes! Okay. Perfect, that's exactly what I wanted to happen. Guaranteed kill, no chance of hitting the barrels. Okay, what what the hell is on that screen? Hey, stop looking at me. Creeper. Is that a screensaver? That's gotta be the ugliest screensaver I've ever seen in my life. Whoa, what the hell? It freezes when I put my light over it. Whoa. Okay, so where am I putting these? Place the first C4 charge on the marker in the underwater tunnel elevator. Okay. Right. So this just became fetch quest the game, sort of. Go to here, kill waves of enemies and whatnot on your way there. And then go here and kill enemies on the way there, and let's get to reuse all of our environments again. It's such a pain to have to make new assets, isn't it? Awkward silence. The automatic defense system is active. The automatic defense system is active. <laughs> Area clear. Doors unlocked. I've got the C4. I've marked the places for you to set the charges. Start with the underwater elevator, then take care of the bridge control room, which is next to the scientific module, and finish with the room before the heliport gate. I'll meet you there when I'm done. Oh, so we're gonna plant the charges and then we're gonna get out of this place in like a big cutscene sort of thing with the elevator, with the uh, the helicopter, right? Maybe we fight a boss or waves of enemies out on that helipad? Yeah. Whoa, what is this? Oh. Oh. There's two. I'm just gonna run away from you then. There's no reason for me to stay here. Bye. Okay, when are you gonna come out? Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Alright, elevator. Elevator, 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 elevator. Um. Where's the elevator? That's the armory. Is this it? Yeah, underwater tunnel, and then the elevator's over there. Okay. Oh, more of those things. That didn't go as far as I thought it would. There we go. Might as well use up the, we the uh, ammo for the most useless weapon in the entire game. You know, I'm amazed. 
how has Anna managed to mark all of these spots? And yet lived. She just ran around and didn't encounter all of these enemies that I've been shooting? Bakarev's Diary. Fascinating! It is a good thing that it hates the light, otherwise it would be virtually uncontrollable. Wait, what are you talking about? Wait, is this talking about a boss? One of the experimental subjects is driving me mad. I don't understand why Victor insists on keeping his failures. This thing is constantly bellowing and climbing the walls and ceiling of its cell. It is a good thing that it hates the light, otherwise it would be virtually uncontrollable. Okay. Maybe a future boss? It's howling made all the lights in the entire scientific module go out. The power was quickly reestablished, but it gave that hideous scream, and the lights died again. Alright, well, maybe they should have thought twice about installing the scream responsive lights. A slight disturbance in the air, like some sort of heat mist. Well, I've already seen that. When it struck hard, when it struck hard enough to injure itself, it faded into view for a moment. Oh my God! <gasps> Holy shit! That's so long. He's hiding somewhere, awaiting metamorphosis. Oh, he's talking about uh, who's he talking about? Victor. Yep, talking about Victor. Oh my, look at how long this is. That's gotta be the longest note in the entire game. Again, normally I read notes, but in this game, I'm sorry, I don't feel like it. Kaboom! Um, I didn't realize that it was set to go off in like five seconds. Could you set the timer for a little bit longer? I assumed this was like a remotely activated thing and it was going to blow up all at the same time, but apparently no. Apparently, the massive C4 has a five second timer. What the hell? Why? Why? Given these massive slow opening doors, I probably wouldn't even be fast enough to get out the door and close it again. All right. Great, it's locked. Right. Well, obviously, I'm never taking the elevator again. Goodbye. Oh, Jesus Christ! Oh. Water. Wait. Where the water come from? I. Well, it's an underwater elevator, so I suppose there's water outside of it. I guess that makes sense. Okay. So, wait a minute. You're telling me... That Ryan is... Ryan is so stupid. He doesn't even set the timer for, oh, I don't know, 15 seconds? A minute? Instead, he sets it for five seconds. So he has to run from the rather strangely slow-moving water. Paced at such a rate that you can outrun it while it dramatically is close on your heels. Okay. Alright, fine. Oh my god, slow-moving water! It doesn't even look like water, it just looks like mist. Are you serious? I'm so glad they put a save here. This is dumb. Wow, this is so dumb. <laughs> I think I died there because I kept accidentally going backwards for a second because when the view changes, 
what was once, you know, I was pressing forwards to go a certain direction, and then when the view switches to the other direction, suddenly you're going backwards. Wonderful. Just, just wonderful. Thank you, game. You're so considerate. Right. Like here, I was pressing forwards to go forwards, and now I need to press... Oh, no, forwards still. And then when it switch Now I gotta press backwards. And then when it switches back to the, uh, the door up here, I'm gonna have to press forwards. Forwards. Okay. Done. All right, now you're gonna pop out, right? Come on. Come on. Come on. Just, ah, just do it already. Ah. <sighs> One of these days, they're gonna pop out. Right, where's the second one? The scientific module bridge control room. Scientific module bridge control room. Scientific module bridge control room. Okay, that is up. Yes, I actually know where that is. Oh, so now they're going to pop out, right? Because I have to go up. Come on. Come on. Come on. You've been waiting the whole time. I know you've been waiting the whole time. Come on. The elevator's gonna stop, and it'll be all like, intrusion detected. Come on. Come on. Seriously. It's not gonna happen. Alright. This over? Oh, yeah. No, I did the right thing. I was worried I messed something up. Right, so... Okay, there it is. This thing looks like it doesn't work. Stuck. Of course it doesn't. So, is this another five-second timer? Probably. What the hell? Some strange behavior from the platform. Also, wonderful camera there. I almost fell off the side about 20 times. Because it kept switching angles. Wonderful. Okay, and the last one goes um, up to the helipad. Which is... Um... Shit, it's out of order. Damn it. Uh, this way. Oh, I gotta go through the place that had the ceiling. The ceiling, um... Yeah, I gotta go through, I gotta go through the place that has the ceiling. That's the end of my sentence. You know the place, the one with the ceiling and the floor. No, the place with the... <laughs> the place with the uh, hatch. That was rattling around, so I'm guessing something's gonna pop through this time when I go through. Alright, let's take a stop at the armorarium. And let's take a stop at the medicinal rectangle box place. Mm. Yeah. Oh, it feels so good. <sighs> Dr. Sunglasses! <gasps> Where's your sunglasses? Your head's gone. Alright, this is The Room. And no, I don't mean the movie. I mean the storeroom. The place with the ceiling. 
Yep, cutscene. What the boss? Oh man. Oh man, that's one. Is it just one of those things? Is that it? Oh. Oh. That's gotta hurt. Alright, you're dead. Where's the other one? Alright, you're up there, you're coming down. Or perhaps you're already down. Oh god. Right, I'm just gonna run over here. Ah. <sighs> AK for the win. Unfortunately, now I've used up most of its ammo. Wait, are you the one that was up there? Alright, well, I'm guessing the door is now locked at a rather inopportune time, because otherwise I could have just avoided them by going through the door. So let me guess, this thing has reset itself to red. Wait, is that green? It's opening. Oh no, okay, yeah, it was locked, of course. You might ask yourself, who hit the switch? It was open last time I was in here. Who would hit the switch? And you know what the answer is? The game developers hit it. Arbitrarily. Ah, those things. Can I avoid them? No. I'll just shoot him in the face. Do they even have faces? I don't know. I believe this is the way to go to get the helipad. Or is it? Wait a minute, it might be broken. The damn thing's stuck. Damn it. No, that's not the way. I was just kidding. I totally know where to go. Oh, hi. SMG time! These things are massive ammo sinks. The upper corridor. Alright, this is where I place a bomb, but where do I go? Leading to the heliport, right. Where exactly is the door to the heliport? Because that's probably where I need to run. I think it's here. Heliport, heliport module, okay. Okay, here we go, now run. <laughs> Sounds like a microwave beeper. Oh, and look, we got action cam! Dun 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 Convenient or inconveniently exploding background. 
Mission accomplished. I'm near the walkway between platforms. There's a helicopter on the other one. They were repairing it when I left. If it's working, I can fly us out of here. You learned to fly a chopper? I had to do something with my time here. Beautiful. I'm on my way. <laughs> you learned to fly a chopper? Is it just me or is, uh, is John's voice just... He sounds dumb. It, it sounds like he's constantly slurring his speech. He sounds drunk. Damn, this thing can put out some bullets. Of course, now I'm out of said bullets. But whilst I had them, it put them out. Ammo for the Ack. Oh, I see you. Come and get me. Huh? Huh? What are you gonna do? I'm inside of a cage. What are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? Hmm? 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 Oh, God. Are you serious? I used a flamethrower on it. I'm on fire. Oh, right. I did just catch it on fire and then it just tackled me. You can flame those things and they can still jump on you. They're so ineffected by flame that they don't even give a shit. Okay then. Oh my god, the tension! Am I gonna live? I don't even know! Mission accomplished. I'm near the walkway between platforms. There's a helicopter on the other one. They were repairing it when I left. If it's working, I can fly it out of here. You learned to fly a chopper? I had to Ow. do something with my time here. Beautiful. I'm on my way. Those things really don't do all that much damage. Right. Definitely time to shotgun this. Or... Maybe I could just run past them? Maybe I should just run past them. YOLO! Screw you guys. I'm going to the heli. You're not worth my ammo, or my time. Yeah, <laughs> just ignore them. Boss? Yes, you. And where do you think you're going with my daughter? Papa? <laughs> I'll keep you covered, Anna. Do what you have to. I better keep searching corpses for ammo. <laughs> what? What? That's a very strange time to say that. What the? What the? F 
What the hell just happened? What? What just happened? He wanted ammo, I was running in a direction, then like half a second later, she was picked up and then load last save. What even... what? Okay... What? <laughs> they they don't even have, like, uh, they don't even show what happens. Just she's picked up and you're done. What am I supposed to do? Anna. I'm gonna launch rockets at his ass. I mean grenades. What the fuck am I supposed to do? Okay, shoot him and oh god. Oh Jesus! To make myself a target just to keep his attention. Okay, I'm just getting his attention. Oh no! Ow! Tom, just a few charges left to set. My God. Yeah, come over here. Just one more. So this is the boss fight. I like I don't even kill him. I just I just shoot him until I get his attention. Wow. Th th this is it. Oh, Jesus, what the I didn't realize he was so close. This is one of the worst boss fights I've ever played. This is horrible. It's immediate death. No satisfaction because you don't even get to kill it or anything. You don't even get to set the charges. The only thing you are is a distraction. Like, I mean, Anna has the more interesting role here and she's an NPC. It looks like if you dodge to his left, you're more likely to avoid it because he swings from the he swings from his left. Or I don't know if I said that right, but yeah. Tom, just a few charges left to set. Looks like I gotta go this way. To avoid getting hit. Alright, so I should probably have him charge away from her. That seems like a rather wise idea. Like, I can just hang back here and just wait and... I better keep searching for ammo. No, I really don't need to do that. I have more ammo than I could possibly use. Ow. This is utterly formulaic and completely unsatisfying. Get attacked once, doesn't even matter, just calmly wait, shoot him in the back. Is this, is this the, the final fight of the game? The end. Get to the shop. I'll hold him off. Oh, do I actually get to play again? I have the chopper off the ground. Then get over here. I can't get close until you kill him. I'm doing my best. I better keep searching close uh, for ammo. Oh god. I think I'm dead. Oh no, I'm not dead. Wait, I'm sorry, I thought this guy's invincible. What do you want me to do? I can't run. I have no resistance. Maybe if 
I let him grab me, I can shoot him point blank. Wait, that's what I need to do. Um, okay. I better keep searching corpses for ammo. No, no, I need him to grab me. Grab me. Grab me. Grab me. Don't charge me. Grab me. Grab me. There we go. Critical hit. Damn it. I mean, yeah. Grab me again. Grab me. Grab me. That's not a grab. Alright, so I need to avoid his attack and then get close to him. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. Grab me. No. Oh my god. Mm, where's my... My last save is from the beginning of the entire fight, isn't it? <sighs> wow. This is a terrible boss fight. I ran the wrong direction. You know what? I've already taken damage. Just kill me. I don't want to run the risk of having to restart the whole thing again. Oh my god. Anna. Gotta run to the left. Oh well. Didn't work. Ow. Ow! My back. Just a few charges left to set. Oh my god. I'm practically dead. Do you have a medkit? I could really use a medkit. That's not a medkit. Alright, I do need to search the bodies for a medkit, if nothing else. Jesus! I'm... I'm dead. It's weird, my tactic to avoid his hits is no longer working. Do I just need to, like, run last second? Like, right now? Don't you stomp on me. Maybe, yeah, maybe I need to run last second, not the entire time. Maybe not. I don't know. Tom, just a few charges left to set. Some ammo that I don't need. Med kit, med kit, med kit. That's not a med kit. Just one more. This guy is incredibly stupid if he keeps falling for the same tactic, the same trick. Again and again. He's invulnerable. Why does he even care that I'm shooting him? It doesn't even matter. He's invulnerable. Come on, Anna. Come on. There you go. And we'll skip that. Pick me up. Pick me up. Pick me up. Pick me up. No. Seems there we go. To get Critical hit. Now he's gonna jump back. Come on. Pick me up. Pick me up. No, don't stop on me. Pick me up. There we go. Come on. Where are you gonna jump to? I'll jump to you. I will come to you. Come on. 
Where you, what the hell are you going? Okay. Oh my god, stop moving. Is that that's it. So you do have remote detonations of the C4. Fuck you, Anna. <laughs> That's the end. That's the end of the game. Wow. Wow. Oh my god. That was one of the worst boss fights I've ever played. And it was the end of the game. And at the same time, they, um... They, <laughs> they introduced the fact that there is remote detonation of the C4, so again, why did I need to set them off with a five second timer requiring me to run precariously from the things exploding behind me? I'd really like to know. Hmm. Anyway. Well, I actually quite enjoyed this game, to a really surprising amount. It's not very good, obviously, it's not very good. It's not very good looking, it doesn't have a very good story, it's fairly generic in pretty much every way. There's really nothing about it that's particularly exceptional. Um, I suppose the gunplay. Like, if I was to say anything that's particularly good about it, it'd be... The gunplay can kind of be fun, especially the shotgun, when shooting the zombie-infected thing's heads. That can be especially nice, and uh, I was really impressed with the the design of the exocells, and the way they stick to surfaces and just all, act all stretchy and creepy. That was actually really cool. But aside from that, yeah, this game is just pure cheese, and it was actually enjoyable. It's not often that I would say I enjoy the game despite realizing that it's not very good at all, but in this case, I did. I enjoyed it. I'm not entirely sure why, but it was fun to play. <laughs> and I don't regret playing it whatsoever. Yeah. I can't think of what else to say about it. I don't know if I really... I don't know if this merits of, like, going really in-depth and analyzing it. I don't- I don't know if there's much to say. It was just cheesy fun. Yeah. Hmm. I wonder if there's a scene after the credits or something. Well. I guess I'll wait and find out. But... Yep, that's the end. That's the end for me, so... I'm gonna leave and you can enjoy the rest of the credits. And yeah, thank you for watching. I had a good time. I hope you did too.